talk to me. Information, news, and entertainment on demand. WSRadio.com. <laughs> Welcome to the Changing Stage, music gear talk from the manufacturers and musicians who define the biz. Here's your host, Florentino Buenaventura. All right, all right, all right. We are back with another show of the Changing Stage. This is brought to you by our fun friends over at Music Power, also Guitar Trader. Uh, they are real musicians making it happen. Uh, and this is powered by the WS Radio Network. And my name is Florentino. We have a great show for you today. We've got a, a great guest coming on. Uh, I think he's still doing some studio work right now, so he's, we're waiting for him to call on in. Uh, Mr. Bobby G, Bobby Gonzalez, the uh, guitar player for some incredible incredible players but while we are uh, waiting for him to call in just want to kind of let you guys know we've got some great shows coming up it's, it's just a, a, an amazing assortment of talent that we're going to have come on and uh, also uh, gear professionals uh you know obviously this week we have mr bobby g and he, uh, he'll be here shortly uh we also have a uh, uh, our uh, fun friends over at Slate Digital with Stephen Slate. He'll be on next week. You really want to take a take a listen to that one because uh, the Slate Raven is just an amazing piece of gear, and uh, he's going to be presenting some new stuff for the Summer Nam, as well as uh, we have Fender coming on on the 19th, and they're going to be talking about uh, the uh, the new products they have coming out, the one of a kind products, and uh, um, we continue on with some talented artists. Uh, Eric E Q Young will be coming on after that on the 26th. So he'll be talking about his longevity in the uh, in the business, playing for Confunction and playing, just being a, the, the sought after bass player. And then on the August 23rd, we have uh, Bruce uh, Valerini. Uh, he is a producer over at Blue Bear Sound. He's one of the top engineers over in Canada. Our fun friends to the north. So I think Bobby's online. Bobby, you there? Hey, I'm here. Hey, what's up, brother? How you doing, man? What's going on, my brother? Oh man, we I just uh, my brother from another mother. What's going on, dude? Hey, dude, you know we've been we 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 are practically man. We've known each other a lot longer than we have it, right? Since we were. That's crazy, right? Kidding. Like Kidding. like that could be a whole whole another fucking show, dude. <laughs> dude. Yeah. Oh my God! Yeah, yeah, it, it, that's my just, boy. Yeah. What's going on, man? Well, hey, man. First off, how's the family, dude? How, how's everybody? Everybody's doing fucking well. Uh, I can't complain. Shit. Oh man, man, and uh, you know you've, you've, so good. you've got a beautiful daughter, uh, and uh, you know you've you've got this this uh, uh, you know. Well, I, I grew up with your family, man. They were like you know they were like raised us all over there in, in Freeport. <laughs> so, Absolutely. So yeah, brother. So tell me, man. We 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 brought you on, uh, uh, you know, about a couple months ago, and we were talking about things, uh, you know, uh, that were happening at that time. You've had some amazing things uh, come about for you. You, uh, you know, let's just kind of start right into it, man. You were uh, uh, selected by by thousands of people for your song uh, "Too Late" to be on the soundtrack of Spike Lee's new movie, "The Sweet uh, Blood of Jesus." How did that How did that all come about, brother? I have no idea, but I, <laughs> let me tell you something. Tino, my brother, look, it comes like this. It happens when it happens, dude. I can't, dude, c- listen. How does it happen? It doesn't happen unless it happens. Does that make any sense? Yeah, it, it, Nobody it, understands that. Dude. Yeah, I, I agree with you, man. The, the, dude, the it's universe. like <laughs> I can't even understand it myself. Yeah. It just happens, dude. You know, everything happens on God's time, man. We've always talked about that in, in, in different kids. Absolutely. And, uh, you know, this and is... if you don't understand that, but, um, but, um, Swipe, when I met him, dude, I met, it's like me, like seeing you for like, a thousand years. I see you like, Tino, what's up? Oh, my God. I just, you know. Yeah, yeah. Dude, same shit. 
Anyway. Yeah, we can go for years without uh, having said anything, but it's like when we talk, it's like we resume, <laughs> resume, you know, that, you know, the, uh, the same old relationship, man. And, you know, I, and just to let all you folks know, I mean, I've seen Bobby play and I've seen him grow in, in, throughout these years and he never ceases to amaze me with his talent and the things you've been able to achieve. Uh, I still remember this story, man. And this, this, this tells you sometimes your teachers aren't always right. Uh, Mr. Cunningham, you know, he was like, uh, uh, you were sitting there in the, in, in, uh, music, uh, music class playing guitar and you were running yeah. away, dude, but you weren't playing what he wanted you to play. <laughs> and he's no, like, exactly. It's just, I played this and he thought I was an asshole. He's like going, <laughs> you know what, dude, do this. I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about. And honestly, I didn't know what he's talking about. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah and then, but, dude, uh, you know, he's like, you know, you know, you're, it. you're fucking brilliant, dude. You're brilliant, <laughs> dude. You bring us shit. Um, dude, it's, it's cracking me up. So I'm like going, I don't remember this shit. I'm going, <laughs> but I'm going, I do remember this. Yeah, oh my yeah, God. Yeah, you bring it up and, uh, you know, I just, I just remember these memories, man. And you were, you were just, uh, we were all so amazed at your ability. And he's like, you'll never make it playing like that. And I was like, and we all knew it was like, that's so full of it. <laughs> But, That's uh, fucking hilarious, dude. So, and, and you know what's what's just crazy is that you now, I mean, you're you're hitting a, a new career. So you you've been this this guitar player, this virtuoso that is the go to player when it comes down to R and B and funk for sure. And then you know I've, I haven't heard anybody do a, a Hendrix like you, brother. But uh, you know from the R and B funk side of things, you have been able to to have just you know an amazing career playing with Earth, Wind and Fire, Lionel Richie, Mariah Carey, Sheila E, The Time. Eric Benet, who just, I, I love that man's voice. Uh, you, know, the, you, the you, you got it better than Duke. I do. You're a good guy. <laughs> I don't even remember the shit like that. You know, it's crazy when you said that. It's, it's fucking, it's fucking me up. I'm going like, <laughs> I did, I did, I've done that. <laughs> That's that. It's just yeah, good. you know, look, look. If anybody, if they don't understand, Tino is my first manager. This must have just believed in me before I believed in myself. It wasn't hard, and I'm though. Wasn't anybody, hard. Dude, dude, you believed in me before I believed in myself. Wow. And it's not like, ah, Bobby, you can do this shit. Yeah. Bob, Bobby, Bobby the, G's new dude, attitude, man. <laughs> dude, I swear to God, I trip on that, man. It's like, well, now you're playing bass, dude. Yeah, so, yeah, I'm playing bass with Curbside. Yeah. I got my guitar player right here. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> so it's 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 pretty. It's a it's. it's know, a this right, is man. A, it, it, this this what it comes down to. It's just like we gonna do this shit till we die, dude. You feel me? Exactly. You feel me? Because it's part of who you are. It's it's your it's why that's why we do the radio show. It's the passion. It's the passion. And I think that's what the listeners need to to realize that it's not about the fame. It's not about the glory. Not about the big crowds. It's about doing what you love and then getting. And, and just proceeding Absolutely. forward. You know, I work with a lot of these young guys, and they're like, "When when's the money going to come? When's this going to come? When's that going to come?" I'm like, "Look, it'll come when it comes." Like you no, said, no, you don't do that. Yeah. It's just, you just do it because you love it. If exactly. you do it because of money, you'll never, you'll never. Oh my God, you, yeah. you, you, you'll never get it. So, and you've you've had, you know, like I said, you now are moving into another career. You're doing. Uh, you, you, yeah. you're, you're doing the movie business, man. You're working with top tier directors, you know, right into it. And, uh, so when you, when you, uh, um, uh, contacted Spike, how did that work? Cause I know it was, a, I know that he, uh, listened to like thousands of songs or they went through his thousands of songs too. He listened to like 800 songs. Check this out, dude. Now, because it's supposed to be, check this out, you know. Now, I call you Tino, because that's how I know you, man. Yeah, yeah, man. But that's, listen, that's, that's, we're family, brother. Listen, listen. Dude, eight out of 800 songs, 12 songs were selected, and we got to deal out of this shit. And wow. check this out. Spike Lee walked into my boy's office, meaning Epic Records. Many, uh, L.A. Reed. Yeah, yeah. And he said, he said, listen, listen to this. Twelve songs, right? Wow. When he was done, we had a record deal. So I don't know what to do. It's so scary because I'm like, does that mean I have a record deal by, by myself? 
watch it. Watch it. So what? you got it here exclusive. I think I'm, I already know I got I got a, I got a record deal, dude. <laughs> I got a record deal, dude. Oh, man. Congra- I didn't like, even realize that, brother. Congratulations on that one, man. I knew that you had the songs it's, placed. It's, yeah, it's, it's going to happen because it's like, it's supposed to happen, man. Yeah. And I thank you. Dude, like, he know, he know, <laughs> dude, you are fucking hilarious, dude. Dude, you know what? You believe in me, you believe in me, like, when no one believed in me, you're like, oh my God, dude, you, oh, it's so fucking funny as shit, dude. Dude, you know, I was, uh, I was talking with Bobby Gerald, you know, on, on Facebook. Yeah. And- and yeah, I, I remember the time we had the uh, that show over the second level, dude. And the, uh, the uh, Bobby Gerald was his first DJ gig. Now he's like a big announcer for ESPN and uh, hey. doing a lot of. He plays. He got his own radio show yeah. on uh, with Neo Soul and 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 Funk and everything. And it's just and uh, Bobby you know. Gerald is fucking sick. You yeah. know, what I mean? yeah. he gets it. He does. He understands the music. You know, he's, yeah, absolutely, you know, his man. Yeah, dad it's, was it's a, beautiful, a, man. Sports guy there. We've had a lot of folks. In fact, you know, bro, uh, I, I had Jay King on on air the other other day, and, and Samuel, yeah. and uh, everybody has nothing but just speaks highly of you. You know, world class talent. That's wow, what oh, man. So, you got Jay King. That's like that motherfucker started the whole fucking shit off in Sacramento. So. Much props to that motherfucker. That that that's a bad boy, man. They don't, we don't give him props, man. Hey, hey Bobby, that's the... I give him. I give him props. That's a bad boy, man. Yeah. We got we got the music coming back on. Uh, hold on, folks. We'll be back. This is Florentino with the Changing Stage with Bobby G on air. Uh, we'll be back in a few short moments. Bobby, just go ahead. And hang on. Thank you for listening to WS Radio. Improve your business and your life with useful information from experts and thought leaders. WS Radio is radio with ROI. You may have heard me brag about Progressive Medical Center and just how much they've helped me with my health. And Dr. Goley, one thing that you've helped so many people with is migraines. Unfortunately, there are millions and millions of Americans who are suffering with migraines and headaches, and they're debilitating because it affects the quality of their life, and they cannot function properly. At Progressive, we get the root cause because we understand that migraines could be caused by nutritional deficiencies, hormonal imbalances, believe it or not, delayed food sensitivities. And once we determine what the real reason is, we put a plan of action together with many medication that we get them off slowly and we put them on a all natural approach and the results are amazing incredible i mean there's so many people that can say they don't live their lives with migraines anymore thanks to progressive medical center and that's what's exciting and rewarding to us as physicians because we help our patients take control of their health and that's why they're living well why don't you get a hold of progressive medical center today don't live in pain don't have migraines anymore just go to their website progressivemedicalcenter.com this is your life live it well Are you ready to get real about your music? My name's Florentino, and I'm the host of The Changing Stage. On my show, we get the real stories of how great music and musicians are made. You know who else is real? The professionals at musicpower.com. They help serious players make music happen with the right advice, direction, and cutting-edge gear. Isn't it time you leave Amateur Hour behind? Then go to musicpower.com. Real musicians, real gear. Hi, I'm Linda Zweig. Listen to Del Mar Fairgrounds Radio every Thursday, 2 to 3 p.m. We host over 350 events every year at the Del Mar Fairgrounds, including the award-winning San Diego County Fair. That's Del Mar Fairgrounds Radio, 2 to 3 p.m. every Thursday at wsradio.com. In the military, things can change in an instant. The Navy Mutual Aid Association, we understand because it's our life too. That's why our dedication to serving the life insurance needs of our military veterans and their families is unrivaled. Navy Mutual offers superior life insurance protection without military service restrictions and limitations. A single focus on providing the peace of mind military families are looking for. That's what we do. Navy Mutual, insuring those who serve. Call 800-628-6011 or go to NavyMutual.org. Hi, this is Rob Barnett, CEO and founder of VinVillage.com and the Wine and Dine Show on Vin Village Radio. Do you have a wine, event, product, or service to promote? Then contact VinVillage.com to reach thousands of wine lovers across the country. Vin Village connects like-minded wine enthusiasts with unique and exclusive wines, events, products, and services. To learn more, contact us on VinVillage.com. 
Bin Village is where wine lovers connect. Talk to me. Information, news, and entertainment on demand. WSRadio.com. <laughs> Welcome to the Changing Stage, music gear talk from the manufacturers and musicians who define the biz. Here's your host, Florentino Buenaventura. We are back on the Changing Stage, powered by WS Radio and brought to you by the Good people at musicpower.com and Guitar Trader, where real musicians talk about real gear. And we have Bobby G back on. Bobby, you there? <laughs> I'm right here, man. What's oh, going on? Oh, bro, you know, we, we were just my going over there. <laughs> I love you, man. This is my boy, Tino. I love what you, man, too, man. <laughs> hey, bro, you know what? Uh, you know, one of the things I wanted to ask you about is you've done a, like a ton of TV shows. You've, you've, you've played yeah. on Jay Leno, you've played on Letterman, Oprah, Arsenio, The View, you, you've been yeah. everywhere. What was the, your favorite show? Who was like the host that you just felt like was just awesome? I, I would say, uh, fucking Jay, no. My boy is, um, damn, I think his name. Um, <laughs> are you talking about, oh uh, you talking about, um, uh, East Coast. Oh, uh, uh, help me out, help, uh, David help Letterman. Me out. Can, uh, yeah, yes. Okay, Letterman is dude. Cool, cool as hell, and the band was sick. Who'd you play They're with? Sick, which, which which group did you play with on Letterman? Was it uh, Earth Wind and Fire? Uh, or? I was with. Uh, I know there's a lot of them, man. <laughs> I know. I'm trying to think. I was um, Lionel Richie. Oh, Lionel Richie. Okay, was now he's doing yeah. that country project, right? He's got that that thing. Are you play, yeah. you playing with him on that one too? Do you like very well best? Good God! <laughs> oh my God, dude! You did you did your homework, dude. You kill me. Yeah, yes, yes. <laughs> oh my God! Bobby's playing country. Dude, you are fucking sick, dude. <laughs> That's why I love you. That's why I love you. You know what? You just you're sick with it. It's like you do your homework, dude. Yes. We were, um, we did, it was a fucking line of Richie shit. And it was, it, we were doing, um, it's like, a, uh, uh, um, help me out. It's, uh, fucking. Well, I see, I see some of the, the video stuff that you had on online. And I just, uh, yeah, yeah, but just it was, mean... uh, it's the, it's the, it's like, hmm. Country shit. So we did that shit. Yeah, you, anyway, can, you definitely can did that shit. You can play anything, yeah. bro. That, that's one thing I've always known about you. you. You put, you know, a sound in front of you. You knew exactly what to do with it, and that's and that's. Uh, no, that's dude, I don't, dude. I just play music, dude. <laughs> yeah. I play music. I don't give a fuck what it's blues. It is better. Yeah, you know what, man? It's and, and you I know think, what? It's just so funny, dude. I have to give you props, dude. You just be, dude. I love you. You understand me? <laughs> dude, Bro, dude it goes way you back. have loved me from, like, you loved me from, like, day one. Nobody even fucking believed in me. And you're like, no, Bobby, you're going to be somebody. Dude, that, that scares me. Wow, dude, man. you got it. That's why I'm, like, I'm here on, dude. Well, hey, man, you know, the talent was pretty evident. <laughs> Not just me. Every, everyone knew that. That's true, though. Yeah, that's, that's true, though. Yeah, that is. It's, it was evident. You, you know, your your spirit to drive to it. Nah, all. shut the fuck mm -hmm. up, dude. You just <laughs> cool. You so, like Bobby. You gonna be somebody, dude? You just believe in me. I'm like, oh, I don't. Yeah, what? Man. When I didn't even believe myself, dude. And it continues, man. And it continues on. You you've got the you know you've got so many good things going on. So you know you also have a, uh, an amazing band. Uh, that that you have, uh, you know, uh, and I'm trying to. I have I had the URL somewhere around here. Uh, where is that one? At? Oh, there. Uh, I lost it. Uh, so what's uh, 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 Join Madness is the name of the band? I'm sorry, I was looking for the the URL. Join Madness is a band. I'm like, if I'm in Sacramento, 
they're gracious to let me play with them. Um, and they're sick. They're, oh, they're, 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 it's a band that is fucking sick. Yeah, you guys Can do. I say fucking sick? <laughs> yeah, it's, if you, if you see it, you'd be like, Tino, you'd be like, I love y'all. Yeah, well, I've, I've been listening, man. You know what I mean? And that's uh, www.joyandmadness.com, folks. You want to yes. go take a listen? Thank you, man. I mean, the, the, man, this band is sick, dude. Yeah, they, you that, got like one of the top dudes. Our front man, Hans, is fucking sick. It's just sick. That is. It's, it's so fucking crazy. You like go, like, really? Yeah, it's, it's like a combination of. Tower Power meets James meets... Uh, Absolutely. Uh, you know. We got three horns. We got a girl on bass. We got an um, amazing drummer. Yeah. Dude, it's, it's sick. It's sick. I put, when you, you see you, it, you're like... You guys, I, can't, I can't even put it in, into words. Anyway. You, yeah, you guys yeah. put the uh, the O in funky. <laughs> definitely like we used to say F-O-N-K-Y no, it's, 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 it's funky dude it's funky dude yeah, yeah it's definitely like onion funk you know what I'm saying yeah <laughs> <laughs> it is definitely it's definitely got going so uh, you know I want to kind of tie back into what we were looking at with uh, um, uh, the, the, the you know Spike Lee movie and yes uh, now did you when you were writing these tracks were you writing these with the idea no, that we were going to be for him I'll tell you how that happened, man. I'll tell you how that happened. Um, the song that I fucking even, fucking even, it's so funny. I just, a girlfriend of mine put the shit on uh, Facebook, right? So I'm like, I look at it. I'm like, oh, I gotta do that. Blah, blah, blah. It's, like, it's like, you gotta do this, you gotta do this, you gotta do this, you gotta do this. Blah, blah. I said, fuck it. I sent two songs. And the last one I sent, I'm being funny because I sent the first song is like R and B, the second song is like retro R, like rock and roll, whatever. Man. Dude, so, next thing I know, I get a call back from <laughs> Spike Lee, and this one gives you like it's just, it's it's the real cat. He's like, uh, you're in the. I'm like, I don't want to hear about no. You're in the fucking. Um, then he hits me back and he's like, dude, your song's on the shit. So, long story short, he's like, hey, it's after, he talks to me like this. He's like, hey, B, can you come to the motherfucking premiere? But we're going to do the blah, blah. He's like, I'm sitting, I'm listening, I'm going, okay, I'll be there. When I meet this cat, man, I meet him, dude, it's like we've known each other forever. Cool motherfuckers. Um, that dude is like, and everybody that was worked, everybody that's worked with this cat, man, they tell me, you're like, he's the most beautiful cat, man. Dude, when I met this cat, <laughs> Hey, Bobby, 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 come over here, come over here, come over here. Wow, yeah, that's... Uh, yeah, dude, trust I've heard, me. I've heard nothing but great things about dude, him. He's, uh, you know, dude, he talent. was just like... It's just favor, dude. It's just like beautiful. It's like, like, I don't know you. He's like, Bobby, Bobby. If I stand in the back, right, mm -hmm. I'm, check this out. We're taking pictures. Okay, I'm in the back, and I'm like, I don't want to be in the front. I'm just being, like, nonchalant with shit. Bobby, 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 come in the front. Bobby, Bobby. Swear to God. Come in the front. He wants me in the front. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't really, I don't know how to explain it, dude. Yeah, man, that's, that's amazing. He just, uh, that, that's just, that is awesome. I don't know. I'm really, I'm really happy for you, it. man. These are the kind of things that you know, yeah, you know, like we talked about. You, you, you were always meant to be doing these amazing things, and you know, like we, we were saying, you've toured with so many uh, talented musicians. What, what so far has been your favorite tour? What was the, what was the project that you really kind of just? I mean, they're all great, so there's, there isn't any one that isn't uh, awesome. But what was that one that just kind of, you know, is, is sitting there in your heart of hearts? Well, I think I have to like 
tell you uh, the time. Um, I'm going to be in the studio. Oh, um, um, Jerome Benton. Yeah, yeah, you met Jerome. No one knows what that is. He calls you like, we need you to be in the studio. And we're looking for Bobby G as, as well. And it's like, Bobby's right here. So we did a fucking tour. It was only, I think it was two, two dates. Dude, if I could, if I could send it to you, oh, yeah. I swear to God, it's the best shit of the time. Yeah. Dude, that shit was so fucking sick. I, I, I remember. <laughs> I, I remember. I, 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 don't, I don't brag about my shit because I don't. I don't give a fuck. You know, I, I'm not. Yeah. I'm cool with me. You know, I'm cool with me, man. But um, that's some shit I will brag about. <laughs> the time is never some. It never some. Never sounded that good. Well, hey, man, those Trust boys me. are bad. I still remember Bobby G's new attitude. You were playing uh, 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 Jungle Love, ah! man, with the band. <laughs> when, hey, we're, when we're doing that out. thing. Hey, check this out. My boy, right now, this is real talk, got 14 songs on Joe's album. Number one album in the fucking land right now. Yeah, so man. if you don't know Joe... Joe, yeah. Joe, they say, hey, my boy got fourteen songs on this motherfucker. That's awesome. Hey, hey Bobby, we got the okay. uh, we got the commercial break coming here. Uh, no, this, we're, we're here with Bobby G, and we're having some just candid talks. My name is Florentino on the Changing Stage Radio Show, powered by WS Radio Networks, uh, brought to you by our fun friends over at MusicPower.com and the Guitar Trader. Be back shortly. You're invited to the Fender Summer Celebration at Guitar Trader, Saturday, July 19th from noon to 5 p.m. Enjoy free food and drink, live music, and more as the Fender product development team demos the latest Fender guitars, basses, and amps. And get your hands on exclusive one-of-a-kind Fender instruments. Bring your guitar with you and get a free Fender restring and tune-up. And get a free gift when you purchase any in-stock Fender instrument or amplifier. That's the Fender Summer Celebration, Saturday, July 19th at Guitar Trader in San Diego. You and your guitar don't want to miss it. Visit musicpower.com or fender.com slash dealer event for details. Love to read but just don't have the time? With Audible.com, you can catch up on reading simply by listening. Audible has the largest collection of digital audiobooks, over 85,000 titles in every genre. Listen to a bestseller on your iPhone, BlackBerry, Android smartphone, or one of 500 other compatible devices. Visit audible.com slash WSRadio today and get a free audiobook when you try Audible free for 14 days. That's audible.com slash WSRadio. Are you ready to get real about your music? My name's Florentino, and I'm the host of The Changing Stage. On my show, we get the real stories of how great music and musicians are made. You know who else is real? The professionals at musicpower.com. They help serious players make music happen with the right advice, direction, and cutting-edge gear. Isn't it time you leave Amateur Hour behind? Then go to musicpower.com. Real musicians, real gear. Are you confused about using social media for your online marketplace business? You know how to run your business, but now you're supposed to be on TwitBook or InstaFace or something like that. The complications make your head spin. Social Beacon by PageMage is here to make it easy. Whether eBay, Amazon, or Etsy, Social Beacon will help you promote and grow your business across social networks like Pinterest and Facebook. And did we mention it's free? You know you need to do it. Start at PageMage.com. Do you want to be a professional coach? Are you in business trying to make a real difference with people you manage or work with? Have you started a coaching practice that isn't quite getting off the ground? Get the skills you need to be a successful coach today with the Coach's Training Program from Accomplishment Coaching. The Coach's Training Program will show you how to help others focus and be more fulfilled. Whether you want to improve your company's bottom line or create a thriving coaching practice, Accomplishment Coaching can give you the distinctions and practices you need to coach others effectively today. Accomplishment Coaching has spent six years developing a cutting-edge coaches training program that will have you ready to coach people professionally in just 12 months, and you don't have to take time off work to do it. To find out more about the coaches training program, just call 1-888-548-6813. That's one 888 
248-648-6813. Talk to me. Information, news, and entertainment on demand. Welcome to the Changing Stage, music gear talk from the manufacturers and musicians who define the biz. Here's your host, Florentino Buenaventura. You are back with the Changing Stage, brought to you by WS Radio Networks and powered by uh, our fun friends over at Music Power, or vice versa. You know, you know how it goes. So, uh, hey, I, before we kind of jump into the rest of the segment, I just kind of want to remind everybody uh, that we've got some great things coming up on the 12th. We've got uh, Stephen Slate of this month. Uh, we also have Fender product team coming on the 19th. They're going to be talking about uh, all the great gear that Fender's coming out. We're actually doing a big event with them over at the Guitar Trader on the 19th right after that where you're going to hear our band, Curbside Vinyl, playing, as well as I'll be your host for the day and talking about all the things that they're going to have with the activities. They've got food. They've got, uh, um, you know, uh, all kinds of things. Bring your guitar out. You're going to get your guitar restringed as well as get a, a tune-up right there on the spot. Uh, and also, uh, we've got uh, Eric E.Q. Young coming on. He's a bass player extraordinaire out of the Bay Area. In fact, you know what's funny, Bobby? I'm going to bring you in now on that. Uh, I met Eric, uh, or E.Q., I should say, because uh, he was named by Don Cornelius as E.Q., um, through uh, making a post about uh, having you on on, on the, the radio show, he he submitted a little comment, uh, you know, saying he was going to be on and listening. Hopefully, you're out there, Eric, uh, EQ, and uh, you know, it's through through you, kind of a, a serendipity. I met EQ, man. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, so he was. Absolutely. So he'll be on. He'll be on at the end of the month. He's a, a phenomenal bass player. Very cool, man. Very so, cool, man. So, tell him I said what's happening, man. Seriously. Uh, I, I will. I will. He 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 loves your he loves your your work, man. And he's just a, uh, you know, a big fan as well as all of us, and you know, as we're of his. So uh, now, you know, I like to talk a little bit about gear, man, because you know we've always talked about that stuff. You know, like you know, you were playing Fender stuff back in the day. I remember your dad was. Uh, you know, playing Fender stuff. I think what, what was it that you guys were playing? Uh, your, your your dad gave you was a it was a Strat, right? No, oh, okay. always a Strat. Yeah, and a Tele. So yeah, that trust me. It's a, you can go back to um, shit, and you can go back. People want to go back to the dumb shit, man. It's always a Strat and a Tele. Yeah, exactly. Believe me when I tell you that. So. Yeah. I've had people look at me like, how the fuck you make a Kelly sound like that? <laughs> it's all about, we can, we can get a, I don't know if we have enough time, but it's, it's oh, about the, we got, we got some time. How, you, how, how you fucking structure your, your rig, man. You can make this shit sound like anything, man. Yeah. Yeah. It's all in, it's really, all in creativity. That's, that's, yeah. So, but you, you but play some different accents. Kelly, that's, that's, that's a, Dude, I always go back. I have, and my Rolls Royce is always going to be um, my motherfucking PRS, man. It's, it's, it's uh, beautiful. Paul beautiful Reed Smith. Yeah. yeah, yeah, we've had them on the yeah, show as well. But, but that, that's, it's so, I don't know how to say it, man. It's like, it's it's like a Rolls Royce of uh, anything. I can play that shit anytime. Yeah, it's a piece of art. But it's definitely a piece, it's, a, it's a piece of artwork for sure. Yeah. But uh, you know, yeah. you you've played all kinds you of know what, gear. You know you want to do what cracks me up though, dude. You playing bass now, man? That shit <laughs> is cracking me up, dude. Like, ask, I'm like, well, uh, hey, I follow you, dude. I'm like going, this fuck is playing bass. <laughs> Yeah, man. No, it's it's, it's it's Paul, my my uh, my producer's fault, man. He twisted my arm. We were, I was actually, I thought I was a singer for a while there. That didn't work out right. <laughs> nah, <laughs> so he, dude, he said, you, are you playing bass, dude? I'm saying you know what you playing too. I'm like, dude. Thank you, brother. Thank you, man. Well, I I, I could dude, I could always go back to the guitar. That's real talk, though. That's real talk, though, man. I I could always go back to the guitar. Remember we did that at the Kennedy uh, High. Uh, um, the, the the talent show. <laughs> Paul gives Absolute, me Oh my don't go back. Oh my god. Yes. Paul gives me yes. a hard time about playing guitar. 
I, I still, I have one, man. I bought one from Elisa's the other day. It was funny. He, I brought it home because it's just, I had to have it just as memories from back in the day. But, uh, so, you Absolutely, know, you know all the years, you've, you've, you've used incredible gear. So you, uh, you always kind of go back to your, your, either your, your strat or your telly. Uh, I see you, I see a lot of the shows that you do is, uh, you know, you're playing, um, uh, you know, uh, PRS and those are, are amazing instruments, you know, and I just, I just, I'm floored by the quality that they put into it and the, the artistry they put into that. What about amps? I think you're, you're using, you know, using different ones. I know that Line 6 is something I'm you've used. using a Line 6. Of, I think they stopped playing. They, uh, they don't even make it anymore. So Line 6 is like, uh, by, um, what's the name? It's like Bollinger, right? What's the oh, name? Oh, oh, oh. I can't. Yeah, so the line six, it's, yeah, it's uh, it's their Bogner line, if I remember rightly, where they have Bogner. Yeah, they yeah. have the Bogner. They oh. don't make it no more, man. And no. I got that, okay. But dude, let me tell you, that shit, I like dialed in the most craziest shit. I got the best clean. I got the best dirty. I got the best, dude. So you're, and that that's kind of a that's a uh, that's a tube emulator that's in there and and you know we're finding that sometimes those tube emulators are not too bad uh paul over here uh plays a uh he's playing one of the uh the vox vxts and and uh, yeah and he's loving that vox is, vox is a very dirty it's a dirty it's a dirty sounding amp man yeah but um and so you what know, i'm trying to tell you then dude you gotta it's like oh my god what am i trying to say it's like I love clean, right? Yeah, you do. I remember, you already know yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You I know, know that. that. I know you that. know that. I love dirty, right? Exactly. No one plays. Dude. No one plays Hendrix like I've heard you play, man. Dude, that amp is sick. Don't make it no more. <laughs> Sick. Well, maybe maybe we should tell him. I'm gonna have to have him on on the show and let him know that that's the one, that's one of the choice hey, for for funk players. And I don't and know who so. you got on. I, and I know you have like your boys on the man, dude. They gotta listen to me, dude. <laughs> I'm I get it when it comes to like tone. Yeah, yeah. So uh, Paul had a couple yeah. of questions for you about gear. Uh, yeah, Paul, you you're, you're here with us. Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, there you go. He has to actually push buttons and talk at the same time. Uh, yeah, uh, the the Vox amp it, it is it is pretty dirty, um, but it's Vox is very dirty. It's a, it's a dirty amp. It's like if you want to get like it's a, and I love the I love the sound of that. Right? It's just it's dirty. It breaks up. Yeah, yeah, and that that's what I've been yeah. uh, been looking for. My my other amp that I've been playing for up till then was uh is like PV Classic Fifty, and it's very very clean, and it's got a ton of headroom. So in order to get you know a little bit of breakup on it, you have to crank it beyond all you know all, all reason. Absolutely. Uh, so so, and and I actually like a little bit of that that grit you know to to start off from. So that's I've been kind of. You know, I love it too, but I love the clean. But you feel me? Yeah, I, I, yeah. First of all, I got I got to start I got to start with the just just clean. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? It's just got to be just like no breakage, it's just just. Clean. So what, right. what, do you, what do you use when you want to add a little a little drive on top of that? Let me tell you this. It's, it's simple. I can use I I, could, I can tell you some head start. It could be a, a thin twin, right? Clean, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So you go clean. The so thin twin is clean, and then I like I might add uh, any kind of pedal, man. It could be. I don't even know, man. Do you have any any favorites? Uh, tube screamers, anything like that? Big, yeah, big I muffs? have that, but it's like I love a lot of um, sustain. Mm -hmm. So that it's, it's it's a whole other world because they don't make that shit anyway. But I love the clean, like me going straight into a fucking man. So here's my question for you, Bobby. Do you still play for distortion? You still use that rat uh, uh, pedal? <laughs> Remember that one, man? Your dad gave you that oh, rat pedal. Oh, <laughs> dude, I'm I'm playing through. Check this out. I'm playing through uh, line six, but I have um, something from Sacramento, man. I wish I knew his name, man. Anyway, it's like a it's a it, it sounds like a 
a 410, in other words, it sounds like a rack of a, like a, you got so you, a stack of dude, and it's like, it's not that, but it's, it's dude, my shit is sick. <laughs> so you're using some it's custom sick. stuff for sure, definitely. And uh Dude, it's sick. Yeah. It's sick. Trust me. Yeah. Oh, everybody everybody comes like, What the fuck are you doing, dude? I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> if you ask me, I'm like, you can have it. I don't trip like that. Yeah. Dude, my shit is sick. And then, and, and you know what? I, we almost actually we almost picked up one of those line six amplifiers uh, not too long ago. Me and Paul do a lot little in, investing in, in gear, you know, and buying and selling stuff so that uh, you know make a little money to pay for the radio show, right? So um, uh, I, I I know a little bit about it, and it had uh, you know it has some great modeling to it and stuff like that. So I I think when you mix up stuff, you know, and Paul, you can kind of uh, uh, you know let me know what you think when you it mix up. It all comes you know, down to what it all comes down to what the fuck. Sounds good. You know what I mean? Yeah. For me, it's like I, need a, I need a good clean and a good, I need a good dirty. Exactly. Does that make any sense? Yeah, exactly. Seriously. Yeah, yeah, you need And um, uh, I, the baddest voice comes to me like, what the fuck is that? What are you doing? I'm like, this is good clean. That, that's Marshall's it. always Marshall's are always clean, yeah. and but I need a good dirty. Yeah, so, yeah exactly. My dirty is dirty, and then the dirty is like, uh, like, uh, hey, Bobby, we're gonna take July dirty. It's like, <laughs> Fourth of July. It's like, like, <laughs> seriously, fifth. it's like, yeah. bah, bah, bah. hey, bro, we're gonna, we're gonna take a, a pause right now, man, for the, for the radio show or for the, uh, sponsors here. This is the Changing Stage Radio Show with Bobby G, brought to you by WS Radio Networks, uh, and with our fun friends at musicpower.com and Guitar Trader. We'll be right back for our final segment. Are you ready to get real about your music? My name's Florentino, and I'm the host of The Changing Stage. On my show, we get the real stories of how great music and musicians are made. You know who else is real? The professionals at musicpower.com. They help serious players make music happen with the right advice, direction, and cutting-edge gear. Isn't it time you leave Amateur Hour behind? Then go to musicpower.com. Real musicians, real gear. You've heard me bragging about Progressive Medical Center and how they've helped me feel so much healthier. But one thing, Dr. Agoli, that a lot of people come to you with is just unexplained pain. They just can't get any relief. Why can Progressive Medical Center's Pain Management Center help them? First of all, we have to acknowledge that pain is for real and you've got acute pain and chronic pain. Here's the problem. That acute pain turns to chronic, which is longstanding, and no one's getting to the root cause. There's several key diagnostic components that help us get to the root of what's causing this pain. Is it inflammation? Once we do a thorough evaluation to get the root cause determined if it's structural or if it's a metabolic issue. And this way, we put an individualized program for pain management involving correcting the spine, using certain injections when necessary, and we get our patients out of pain quicker and they stay out of pain because we teach them how to live their life well. Don't let yourself live in pain any longer. Get a hold of Progressive Medical Center today at ProgressiveMedicalCenter.com. Progressive Medical, this is your life, live it well. You're invited to the Fender Summer Celebration at Guitar Trader, Saturday, July 19th from noon to 5 p.m. Enjoy free food and drink, live music, and more as the Fender product development team demos the latest Fender guitars, basses, and amps. And get your hands on exclusive one-of-a-kind Fender instruments. Bring your guitar with you and get a free Fender restring and tune-up. And get a free gift when you purchase any in-stock Fender instrument or amplifier. That's the Fender Summer Celebration, Saturday, July 19th at Guitar Trader in San Diego. You and your guitar don't want to miss it. Visit musicpower.com or fender.com slash dealer event for details. Do you want to be a professional coach? Are you in business trying to make a real difference with people you manage or work with? Have you started a coaching practice that isn't quite getting off the ground? Get the skills you need to be a successful coach today with the Coach's Training Program from Accomplishment Coaching. The Coach's Training Program will show you how to help others focus and be more fulfilled. Whether you want to improve your company's bottom line or create a thriving coaching practice, Accomplishment Coaching can give you the distinctions and practices you need to coach others effectively today. Accomplishment Coaching has spent six years developing a cutting-edge coaches training program that will have you ready to coach people professionally in just 12 months, and you don't have to take time off work to do it. To find out more about the coaches training program, just call 1-888-548-548. 
1-888-548-6813. That's 1-888-548-6813. Talk to me. Information, news, and entertainment on demand. WSRadio.com. <laughs> Welcome to the Changing Stage, music gear talk from the manufacturers and musicians who define the biz. Here's your host, Florentino Buenaventura. You are back on the Changing Stage radio show with Florentino Buenaventura. We are powered by the WS Radio Networks and brought to you by MusicPower.com, where real musicians play real gear and tell you about that real gear. And we have Mr. Bobby G, uh, music hey. virtuoso, guitarist, songwriter, composer, um, now uh, uh, soundtrack writer. Man, you do it all, brother. We're back on. Hi, are you there, Bobby? Yes. Oh, cool, cool, cool. So, you know, we've talked about some really cool things. We talked about your, uh, you know, you're getting your songs placed on Spike Lee's, uh, new movie. Uh, you've had yeah. this amazing career playing live. Uh, you've, you've also done a lot of TV shows and, and now you're kind of going into a recording career as well. You're getting, you got a record deal going on. Uh, now through all that stuff, you know, I'd like to, we'd like to share a lot with some of the, the, the listeners that are just kind of getting into the business. Tell me, man, how has the business changed in, in all these years that we've been doing it? What have you seen that uh, was, you know, is really kind of blowing your mind as of late? Yo, let me tell you, it's, it's simple. It's fucked up. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> like, really? Um, you know, I can talk to you like this, man. You brought, you brought me on. Um, it's fucked up. It's fucked up. It's definitely just going um, change, for sure. Dude, there's a saying. It's not what you know, but the who you know. Yeah, man. Honest to God. Yeah. It, 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 How I got connected with Spike Lee, man, it's like, it's not it's not about what I knew. It's about, because I knew him. Yeah, yeah. And I didn't even know him. That's a long story, even in itself, but. Dude, but you had people that were that connected dude with him. That take care of me, man. He's yeah. like, and he understands. Check this out. That cat is so cool, man. He's like, I, I he's like going like, I'm going to take 12 cats, right? Mm -hmm. And he's like, I'm going to make, he went to L.A. Reed. He said, listen, I'm going to take my phone off. Shut everything off. Listen to this shit. And guess what? There's a record deal that came from that shit. That's just awesome, bro. He did that because he's Spike Lee. Spike can do that shit, right? You yeah. feel me? Yeah, it's yeah. like it's who can do that shit, right? Yep. So out of that, somebody is going to come out and be prosperous. Guess who is going to be that? Well, I'm hoping that y'all, both both of you, everybody. No, nah, it's going to be hoping, me, dude. Yeah, yeah, it's going to be me. Definitely. <laughs> well, I, I, I already know it. I, well, yeah. hey, man. That, that's why I, I've, been, I've been following you for many years. We've been in contact. Obviously, we don't live in the same city anymore. It, the funny shit is, listen, I will never, ever disrespect you, dude. You've been, like, in my corner since. It's the craziest shit. <laughs> Tino. Hello, everybody. But this one has been like in my fucking corner since day one. You believed in me since day one. We ain't together, but you believed in me. I got my first band because of you. Because you're like, Bobby, you can do this. I'm like, what? I know. Anyway. <laughs> man, it, it, it no. definitely it's, a lot it's, of memories it's for sure. It's beautiful, man. Yeah. And, you, and you're beautiful, man. And guess what? I will never forget you, man. Oh, thank you, brother. You much, believe much in love. me more than I believe in myself, dude. That's and, real and talk. And it continues, man. And you know, I, you know what I've, I've I've noticed too in the business, it's 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 hard for these players to who are coming up. 
you know, with technology has made it really cool to do stuff in your, your, your room and put it up on YouTube and make it happen. I was, we were talking with Jay about that, that, you know, it, it's a lot more democratic these days where you can actually get heard. But the other thing is because of all the crutches and all the other things, it doesn't challenge the character, it seems, as much as it did when we were first coming up in the business, man, that, you know, you had to, you had to be on your mark. You had to be a player of players. You couldn't just put something, you know, uh, you know, that, that was, uh, Absolutely. You couldn't just come much, you know, dude. And I don't want to take much of your time with this, but it's like, dude, if you know how to, like, record, it's simple. You know how to do it. Yeah, yeah, it's, man, it's quite These changed. youngsters, man, they make a beat and they're making the money. It's, yeah. it's, but guess what? These cats cannot come through and, like, come through live. It's, it's, it's horrible, man. Yeah, it's, 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 terrible. it's horrible. It's horrible, man. I got hopes for, I, I, for it. I got hopes for the generation though, man. I, I, I believe that, uh, you know, I think there's a, there's a growing, like, uh, um, organic movement to get back to real instruments and, okay. uh, and guitars, I'm sick you know. with you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So I, I, think, I think there's, I think there is, it's going to take a little while. You know, we, I think that R and B is going to move past electronica sound, go back to the roots of, you know, soul music. We see that nowadays with, with Pharrell, uh, you've got, uh, uh, you know, blurred lines with Robin Thicke where they're, they're they have to go back to but where it came off, from, but right? But check this out. Even Pharrell, Pharrell is not even, and, and, and I don't, I'm not going to call it, I call him out on a sense. It's like he knows what it is, but he can't do it. Understand yeah, that? Yeah, I'm yeah. not calling. He, he he can't play the shit. He he's got a good ear, man. He does. He does. I mean, that's what I get. I get for real that shit. He's like he can hear that. She's like, this is yeah. I like that. He'll he'll like call out now, Rogers. Shit, he's like a, he gets it, right? Yeah, yeah. So he knows the player. So but we've had he had, can he cannot play that shit though. Yeah. Understand that. Yeah, yeah, no, he can't. He'll tell you that. But hey, if you can, nah, get, if you can get Niles, you can, yeah, you, you, you can, can get in there playing. That's true. So yeah, I mean, yeah, he, hey. he had Nathan and Omar Akeem playing drums on. Uh, well, well, that's Daft Punk, but he sang the song for for Get Lucky. So I mean, not too bad. Absolutely. But I think I think that's one of the things. He'll that tell our, you, man. Our our show really tries to drive is that. We, we try to, I try to bring on players that, that will inspire people to, uh, you know, to, to reach new heights. And, you know, we've been so blessed and fortunate for everything from the heavy metal side with, uh, Michelangelo Batio or John Christ to you, you know, for the R&B funk pop, now country with Lionel, Lionel Richie, um, to obviously Nathan Easter, you know, I, who, who hasn't he played with, right? Uh, we've got some other folks. Actually, yeah, I don't know. Did you ever play with, uh, Benny Reitfeld? Where you, I know that uh, play with play, who? Benny Wrightfeld. He used to play with Sheila Bass, and now he's playing with Santana. No, oh, okay. no. Okay. I would love to though. Yeah, he said he's actually coming on. We're we're trying to work out the, uh, yeah. the, the schedule, but he'll be coming on. I figured maybe there was a, a a cross, and she played with Sheila, and he used to play with Sheila. So you know we've got. Well, put me on, put me on the show, dude. I want to meet him, man. <laughs> you know, I'm serious. That's 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 real talk, dude. Yeah, yeah. hey, you know, we will we will definitely. We're, you know, we're gonna be coming music back is, time time again. Check this out. Music is music, dude. It it doesn't matter. It's like it doesn't matter. It, it could be you can be funky, you can be rock and roll, you can be. It doesn't matter. It's as long as it comes from the good, heart, right? It's good. Yeah. So good, know. yeah. Hey, bro, we're almost uh, to the, the the final uh, break here, and I just kind of want to give a shout out to uh, our fun friends at uh, Music Power and Guitar Trader. They've got a big uh, event. You, we talked about Fender. They're going to be doing a big event on the nineteenth over at uh, okay. uh, Guitar Trader. Our band, uh, Curbside Vinyl, is actually going to be playing that event as well as I'll be hosting. And you folks, come on out. You're going to get your guitars strung for free. Uh, they'll do a tune-up right there. Uh, you're going to get food drinks. They're going to be giving away some special prizes and stuff like that. Uh, you know, it's going to be an amazing time, so you want to make sure you come out for that. As well as you listen in for the shows next week, we're going to have uh, Stephen Slate. And then after that, we've got uh, Eric E.Q. Young. Hey. Tell them to like sponsor me. Shit, <laughs> I need that. Fuck that. We, uh, hey, bro, you know we, we, me, dude. We'll, we'll connect you up with some folks <laughs> for sure. Tino in the motherfucking house. I love you, dude. You're love you so too, like, brother. Dude. Love you're, you too, man. You're fucking amazing. You're amazing, so, dude. There you're is amazing. That's, that's the music there. Uh, again, uh, this is the changing stage. 
uh, powered by the WS Radio Network. And just thanks again for MusicPower.com and Guitar Trade. You guys just are awesome. Uh, and thank to the Lord above for you know giving us the opportunity to uh, express our love and our passion for the music in so many crazy ways. We'll be back next week. Take care. Are you ready to get real about your music? My name's Florentino, and I'm the host of The Changing Stage. On my show, we get the real stories of how great music and musicians are made. You know who else is real? The professionals at MusicPower.com. They help serious players make music happen with the right advice, direction, and cutting-edge gear. Isn't it time you leave Amateur Hour behind? Then go to MusicPower.com. Real musicians, real gear. Take a break from politics. Tune in and learn something. WS Radio shows are worth your time and are filled with tips and advice. Add us to your lunch routine and we'll give you a meal for your mind. This is Bill Gruber with BizVid Communications, a Southern California video production leader. We've been honored to sponsor, produce, write, and host many of the fine programs on WS Radio over the years. So we understand how important the Internet and your website exposure are. As video producers, we know the tricks and secrets to incorporate video to increase your search engine optimization and business success. Visit bizvidcommunications.com to see what we can do for you. B-I-Z-V-I-D communications.com. You're invited to the Fender Summer Celebration at Guitar Trader, Saturday, July 19th from noon to 5 p.m. Enjoy free food and drink, live music, and more as the Fender product development team demos the latest Fender guitars, basses, and amps. And get your hands on exclusive one-of-a-kind Fender instruments. Bring your guitar with you and get a free Fender restring and tune-up. And get a free gift when you purchase any in-stock Fender instrument or amplifier. That's the Fender Summer Celebration, Saturday, July 19th at Guitar Trader in San Diego. You and your guitar don't want to miss it. Visit musicpower.com or fender.com slash dealer event for details. We see it every day. Courts overflowing with frivolous lawsuits. People losing all of their assets simply because they were unprepared. The best defense against unscrupulous predators and creditors is a good offense. At Corporate Direct, we use the latest legal tools to help our clients of all sizes and from all over the world create a strategy to protect what is theirs. Think asset protection is only for the wealthy? Think again. Our Cover Your Assets strategies and tools are very affordable and practical. Industry leader Corporate Direct is owned and operated by attorney and best-selling author Garrett Sutton. Give us a call at 1-800-600-1760 or go to CorporateDirect.com to see how we can tailor a CYA plan for you. That CYA, Cover Your Assets with Corporate Direct. 1-800-600-1760. That's 1-800-600-1760 for CorporateDirect.com. Hi, this is Felix Taverna, host of Race and Sports Radio. Join our cast and crew every Saturday and Sunday right here at WSRadio.com, beginning at 8 a.m. Pacific, 11 a.m. Eastern. Race and Sports Radio.